Welcome back to Triple X Learnings. Today we have this question a square minus b square equal to 13. So friends, question is that how we can solve this? You can put this value for a and b and you can calculate in such a way that this is what suppose you have a natural number 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 and so on and you can put any number okay obviously a should be greater than b then we have a positive value so here if i am taking value for a you know 2 as 2 so 2 is square 4 4 and i am taking value for b 1 4 minus 1 is square that is 3 so it is not there then i am taking value for a is 3 so 3 is square is 9 and then b is what 2 so 9 minus 4 is coming 5 that is not there in the same way if i am taking value for a as 4 so a equal to 4 so a is square 16 and b is 3 9 16 minus 9 that is 7 it is not there so in the same way if i am taking you know value for a and b so it will take some time so what i am just going to do a square minus b can be write as a minus b into a plus b that is equal to 30. Now your magic starts from here. a minus b and a plus b. These two numbers are there. If I am considering this subtraction is what? 1. It comes suppose 1 and this one a plus b if it will be 13 sum of two numbers will be 13 then as a product of a minus b into a plus b that is 1 into 13 that gives us 13 so what i am just going to do here i just factorize 13 1 and 13 two factors are there so that's why i put here a minus b as 1 and a plus b is 13 so i am having this value a minus b equal to 1 and a plus b that is equal to 13 now, now if i am uh, adding this two number minus b and plus b so we have a 2a and 1 plus 13 that is coming 14 so a equal to 14 upon 2 that is a equal to we have 7 and if we have a value for a i can find the value for b because we have a minus b as 1 and here i have value for a is 7 so after putting the value for a 7 and this is b so b will come here so we'll have and a will come this way so 7 minus 1 is what 6 so we have value for a and b a is 7 and b is what 6 so that if i am putting here a square minus b square this is our lhs term so if i am putting value for a so here 49 outcome will be 49 and i am putting value for b as 6 so here 36 so 49 minus 36 it is coming 13 that is our rhs so in this way we can calculate the value for a and b so that we have a satisfaction of this result more videos like this please subscribe my channel thank you so much